Sam, I need your help. Okay, what's up? How do I put the oven to 425 degrees? I need to cook someone. Someone? People even do this anymore? is happening my android friends welcome to friday's episode of the mandroid show happy friday tgi freaking f to all your faces i am david of course the mandroid mr mandroid hosting this show that you are watching currently on your computer or mobile device or if you're watching it on your big screen tv i'm sorry it probably looks like crap anyways guys let's talk some android so the breakfast was Good. Saw what they were actually serving for breakfast, and yeah. Looked delicious. I actually overslept, so I missed the event because I forgot to set my alarm. Yeah, oops. <sighs> there was no other reasons why I overslept. Get out of here. Yes, Android 4.3 was finally available to us, and yeah. It's cool. Not many differences from like surface features, you know, just features that are right in your face, more like, you know, within the innards of the OS. Yes, those Android core elements were enhanced, such as better photosphere, we got better gaming graphics for when games finally get up to the open GL, or I think it's called that, right? And of course, smart Bluetooth technology, it's all just good, it's a polished OS, what I asked for, what I'm thankful for. Thank you, Google. Some of you out there are already and currently enjoying Android 4.3. What do you like most about it? Let me know down below in the balls area. How is that extra butter going for you? <laughs> then we got the Nexus 7 II, or new Nexus 7 as they're calling it, you lazy guys. Yes, the second generation Nexus 7 was unveiled to us, and who's gonna buy me one? All right, I know, I always ask you guys to buy me stuff. It's lame, it's sad, it's pathetic, so you know, just, just send me the money. I'll buy it. Yes, it is a pretty sexy successor from the previous one. Wow, that was a lot of th 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 Did you order one? Are you planning on ordering one? How excited are you? Let me know down below in the balls area. <laughs> Who remembers the Nexus Q? <laughs> it's okay because the monstrosity was that big ball is now this fucking thing. Chromecast was shown off and it's a nifty little device that you plug into your HDMI port and you can stream video, music, and internet right on your TV and you can control it with your tablet and or phone. Yes, it does support Chrome OS, so internet browsing will be nifty and nice for, you know, important stuff. They are selling like hot pants, folks, and selling so fast that they actually took away that three months of Netflix for free just because people went buck wild on this little tiny thing. I know that feeling. Wait, that, that, was, that made me not look good. If I would suggest go through Amazon, it costs $35 like it would on Google Play, but you'll get immediate and free shipping because yeah, Google, they're slow pokes. With all the resources Google has, they should be able to beam the fucking thing into my hand right now. But yeah, so I'll have the link down below to get through Amazon. Hopefully it hasn't sold out. It might have sold out, but Amazon's pretty good at being stocked up with certain things. So check down below, I'll have a uh, link for you to click. Order that thing, let me know if you did or if you already did and how you like it. Let me know everything down below in the balls area. Well, all right guys, that's all the Android news I wanted to talk about. Time for that hot, nerdy, sexy portion of the show. Yes, the hot, nerdy girls are becoming few and far between, but I'm still finding them and I would like suggestions from you guys as well. So this week's Mandroid Hot Nerdy Girl of the Week is Yvonne Strahovski. Havski. as bleh. Strahovski. Ah, gee, I wonder what country she's from. She's a regular at Comic-Con, she's a nerd at heart, and she's in that show Chuck, which she plays a badass, you know, spy chick girl, and yeah. She's hot, enjoy these pictures. Shabby at all. If you have a hot nerdy girl suggestion, leave down below in the comments area. I would appreciate it. Also, I'm going to be doing an Ask the Mandroid sometime this weekend, hopefully. So if you have any questions for me, 
tech or personal, leave it down below in the balls area as well. Well, all right, guys, hit that like, thumbs up button if you like today's show. Make sure you subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. And please subscribe to my other channel, The Film Junkie, where I do movie news, film reviews, and those autocorrect fails. I'll have a film review of The Wolverine up later, so keep an eye on what? You ever just lose your train of thought like in the middle of a sentence? That's exactly what happened right there. Like, all of a sudden, a spot on the wall became more interesting. No, but keep a lookout for my uh, Wolverine film review later. It'll be probably up later tonight, or you can watch it tomorrow, or whenever you see this. Just click over there when you're done. This is YouTube. Alright guys, I am David, your Mandroid, and this has been The Mandroid Show. Ah, I really shouldn't have had that monster. It tastes so good though. It's bubbly, sweet, and just like nectar of life. Okay, this is getting gross.